good morning guys yeah it's good morning from this video and welcome back to my channel yeah so today i'm going to be showing you guys a typical day in my life what it is like during lockdown yes during lockdown because i'm still on lockdown work hasn't resumed fully yet for, for me i'm still working from home yes guys so i'm just um at this point i'm trying to stretch out and um wake up fully yes sort of like boots <laughs> so the first thing i do is uh, to drink water yes i always have water by my bedside so i just grab it and um and i drink it because water is life water is good it's good to take water in the morning to refresh your system to start up your system to keep your body moving yeah benefits of water early in the morning <laughs> okay guys so um after that i just um get my devotion now book and um head on to do my devotion in bed yes so i use this devotion i got from my mom uh i i really i i, I love it like i think i prefer it to some other ones that i've used yeah so um it has a topic the scriptures and then this prayer declaration on each day and it also um has this bible reading like you can sort of read your bible in a year following it it will give you the um the chapter and the verse to read every day so you sort of read your bible it breaks it divides the bible into sections so that you can read every day and cover it for a complete year yeah cool right <laughs> yeah so i just do my devotion and then after i read the devotional book after that i go ahead to pray and um yes that's what i'm doing right now <laughs> okay so after my devotion i just meditate and then um yeah i just meditate on it and um just try to get a hang of myself and get um what's it called now just try to kickstart my day refresh my brain think of everything i have to do for the day yeah so that's just it <laughs> don't mind me i was laying down back on my bed to see whether i can catch like one minute sleep but the work that i had to do that day told me to better stand up immediately like stand up you have work to do <laughs> so yeah so today i thought to i thought to clean and declutter my house my room and uh, I thought to film it and upload it here for you guys to watch right mm -hmm. so at this point I'm up from bed I just go ahead to open the curtains to let in light yeah I open the two curtains because I have two windows in my room yeah so I just open the curtains and let um, light coming to make the room brighter i will also be turning on the lights to so that i can get enough um light and yeah I'm trying to stretch my body here just to yeah just to be a bit more flexible for the work that i have ahead <laughs> so i go ahead to lay my bed yeah i lay my bed and um it's good to lay your bed first thing when you when you get up it's good to lay your bed so that you, you start you have a fresh start yeah so now i just get my cleaning equipment or my cleaning tools and that's my cobweb brush i'm just trying to check if there's any cobweb around because i've not been around for like 10 days i was away 10 days for the solar break at my sister's place so i just got back and i thought to clean yeah this is me just goofing around with my mask yes because i need to protect my nose from dust i don't want to start sneezing and coughing because of dust so yeah i start sweep, sweeping the rug now 
because uh, I want to take off this rug so that I'll be able to clean the floor properly so I'm just brushing out the rug now and then I'm going to roll it off the floor as well yeah so I'll take it off the floor and um, look for somewhere to put it but before then I will take it off and dust it also to dust off any sand or dirt <laughs> so I use the broom to also dust it yeah <laughs> and then when I'm done I'll just look for somewhere to put it and then the real cleaning starts so it's time to sweep sweep and sweep proper sweeping yes this room is a yeah so you have noticed you would have seen my fridge and fan in some of my videos yes this room is a self-contained room it has everything inside so it's just room kitchen and um, the bathroom and toilet that's why you have my fan and some other things lying around on the floor so i just sweep i push them aside so that i can sweep every nook and corner yeah it's good to do this kind of cleaning once in a once in a while i try to do mine maybe once in a month you can do yours maybe once in a month or once in three weeks yes it's good so that you can clean up um deaths from every corner of your room yeah so i'm going to clean under sweep under the bed as well yes but uh i couldn't reach to the end of the other wall yeah so i'm just going to go ahead to push out the bed so that i can sweep from the other side the other angle if you want if it gets me <laughs> you understand right yes yeah, so i push the bed and i sweep from this other corner out I shift the because that's the side I have my shoe rack also so I also move it and sweep so this is what I swept out to the dirt <laughs> yeah so um after sweeping the room the kitchen is just opposite the main entrance door so I also swept the kitchen and then um, brought out some stuff swept it properly but i wasn't able to film because um i thought of moving the cameras moving the camera here and there wasn't easy at all i mean i tried my best to capture just the room but i also cleaned the kitchen thoroughly yeah so after that after sweeping i get a piece of rag and then i start cleaning I clean surfaces surfaces <laughs> so this is me just cleaning my bed frame yes the wooden bed frame i'll clean it and then i'll clean the burglaries yes to clean up um dust and yeah all of that so i clean both windows and um yeah i also clean um my tv stand i clean the frame of my tv too yes and um yeah and also the fan yes guys this is very important because i use my fan very very well my fan is like my ac in my room yes so i use it all the time so i it's, it's good to clean it i try to clean it at least once a week or if i if i try 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 i clean like two times a week it's good to clean it so i can get off all the dust so that the dust doesn't so that as the fan rotates the dust doesn't circulate and then cause you catar or allergies and all of that yes so i finished cleaning the fan and i'm closing it back properly very important please when you open your fan close it properly so that you don't turn it on and then the cover just comes off right so secure it well so after cleaning surfaces now i'm going in with my mop I mop the floor my my mopping water i mix i mix some um, the detergents i mix some um, bleach i mix a type of bleach i don't want to call names and then i mix some um, sanitizer and then air freshener yes guys i spray air freshener in my mopping water <laughs> yes so i mop every nook and cranny yes this is me squeezing the mop and then i'll go over again 
yeah so um yes <laughs> so after squeezing the mob i mop this other side and um i try my best to mop every angle so that i can take off all the deaths yes I also um, stretched the mop under the bed, yes, because um, since I swept under the bed, I should also mop under the bed, right? Right? Yeah, so since the mop is longer, I was able to stretch it under the bed very well. Yeah, so this is continuation of the mopping. As you can see, some things from the kitchen. I brought out some stuff from the kitchen and also mopped the kitchen. So when I was done, I laid, I brought in things back, all the things I, I took out, the rug, I replaced it back, I arranged the fan and the fridge back where they were supposed to be, I connected what I needed to connect, the extension, and all of that. So guys, at this point, there was a break in transmission, because never happened, or is it PHCN? Yeah, and my phone battery was low, so I couldn't continue filming. But at this time, I had already finished decluttering the kitchen. I threw out stuffs I didn't need anymore. And um, I had my bath. I had my breakfast. I pressed my phone. Yes, I still had a little battery to press phone. <laughs> I pressed phone and then I started decluttering my wardrobe. So at this point, the light was back. And then I was able to plug in my phone and continue vlogging this. So this is me just bringing out my some of my clothes trying out the old ones to see if they still fit because as at this year as at last from last year to this year i'd added some inches yeah so i was trying out some of my old clothes hmm. guys as you can see even before i finish wearing these clothes this dress or this gown you can see that nah it's not my size it needs to go right <laughs> It needs to go and to, we need to move it to the next generation <laughs> So I'm trying out the second one. This one was given to me by my big sister It's good to have elder sisters, right? They just pass on things. I have a younger one too So I pass on to her. This one too did not fit So I go ahead to try the third one. This one was also given to me by my big sister So I try it <laughs> still didn't fit yeah and added weight lots of it i'm trying to shed now <laughs> so that's the essence of decluttering guys that's the essence of decluttering you tend to move out stuff that you don't need stuff that have been lying for so long in your wardrobe or in your space yeah so i tried this this was given to me by one of my friends and colleague i tried this and it fits yay and i was happy like i could still rock this yeah you know i'm wearing a dress inside so once i style it well it will look okay yeah so at this point i was hungry i had cooked lunch it was already late in the afternoon and uh, guys guess what i'm eating bold yam and red oil <laughs> i mean red oil is my best combo to have with bold yam i don't know about you please let me know those that are with me on this table leave a comment in the comment section if you're like me especially when i mix salt and dry pepper wow wow <laughs> so i had finished eating and um <clears throat> sorry i finished eating and now i was left with just um arranging some other random stuffs and um i decided to sit on the floor to continue guys that basket sitting beside me has been in existence since 2002 yes it has been in existence since 2002 <laughs> i don't know how it was able to survive yeah so i was just arranging my some of my books my jotters inside this basket because i mean it's still the basket is still in existence so let's use it then i found my present phone case it's been it's been it's now an old phone yeah so I found it and then I thought of, yeah, let's recycle it. I'll use it as a jewelry, as a jewelry box. <laughs> so this is me just, I found these pieces of paper in my book, in some of my jotters. I checked them. Obviously, I don't need it anymore. 
Yeah, I mean, what's the, what's the need of decluttering without trash, right? If you declutter and you don't have trash, that means you've not decluttered. <laughs> so, yeah, um, just arranging some random books inside that basket of mine. Yeah, it's really handy now. And, guys, I got this um, stand. They say the suction stand. I don't know. I've tried mounting it in the bathroom. It's supposed to be for the bathroom, but I don't know if the tiles in Nigeria is not accepting this kind of something i don't know but i've had this for a while now and i can't make use of it i don't even know why i'm still keeping it please if you know how i can mount this on the wall please leave me a comment below because i mean my next decluttering i might just end up trashing it and forget and um i mean it's my loss so at this point i'm just arranging the wardrobe well and then i found these two old jeans and what do you do to your old jeans as for me i cut it to three quarter <laughs> i cut it and it becomes a lounge jean or a quick errand kind of jean and um this one i did not cut well but i will still cut it <laughs> so at this point it was already late in the evening around past nine to ten ish and it was time to go have my bath yes so i hopped into the shower sorry it's not shower my own is bathroom bathroom yeah so i hopped into the bathroom i had my bath i was out feeling all fresh and cozy and um yeah nighttime routine i just um get my face cream Maybe I should do a skincare video on someday. Yeah. So my face cream and then lotion on my hands and my feet only because I cannot be sweating in the night. <laughs> and then I spray in um, my body mist because I need to be smelling all nice while I sleep. <laughs> yes, guys. And then um, I just put on this nightgown that I had to beg my sister very well for. But she ended up dashing me. And yes, I put on my hair net and I'm ready to go to bed. <laughs> so guys, yes, um, this is me ready for bed and not without my bottle of water. Very, very important. So I have my bottle of water with me. I'll take some now and then um, keep the rest by my bedside for the next morning or for in between in between in between the nights yeah so it's time to sleep and then i'll just lay down on my bed and i make sure to say a prayer before i sleep yes very important to start your day with prayer and end with prayer right yeah so this is me just um uh, yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up comment leave a comment below share to your family and friends and i'll see you in my next video good night and light out <laughs>